Hello everyone, Sigler here. Bork, chef, you can call me whatever you'd like. So it's been a while. I've been super busy with work and uh, yeah, life and the family and everything. So I haven't posted pretty much anything. Well, I haven't posted anything in a very long time. And um, yeah, I, the only thing I've been doing in game is like one raid and the world bosses. That is pretty much it. And yeah, I haven't played pretty much anything at all, basically. So, but yeah, I've, for the first time ever, I've done Molten Core. Like, sure, I've done it on, like, higher levels and stuff like that, but, like, not current. So, and I don't know if you would actually, like, call this current, I guess, because it's Season of Discovery. So, like, it's a, another version. But, yeah, um, it's, like, I've done it once now, and I'm planning to do it again on Sunday, uh, hopefully. And yeah, it was just super fun to do. And uh, both the the items that I reserved dropped, which was awesome. Um, I like the the thing I want to reserve first is uh, so I can get my six six set uh, like six piece bonus. And the reason is, uh, well, I'm on my rogue at the moment. But the the reason I want to do that is because I want the the uh, there we go, and the six-piece bonus here. Uh, well, both the four and the six-piece is just great. So it will be perfect for me with the playstyle that I do and like boosting people and yeah, just AW farming. So it will be just perfect to have. And uh, yeah, they, it was really a interesting run, uh, to say the least. Um, I... I am super, like, like I'm I'm very happy that the guild Nox that I'm part of, and uh, like, uh, they uh, they had a patient because like it's my first time and sure, it it wasn't like that hard really, but it's still the, the first time. So I came into this quite nervous, but uh, the uh, raid leader. Uh, what was it? Kaosu? Ka Kaisu? I think it was. Uh, it was uh, Kosuki. Uh, helped me and he had a lot of patience with me. So, yeah, it was... It was a very fun experience to do this. And uh, we... I almost actually got four set Because there was two other pieces that w got rolled out to everyone. But I lost those two, unfortunately. But I also got the, uh, like, flame pants uh, from uh, one of the bosses with, the, like, the tank ones. So, yeah. My first run was three pieces. So, I'm very happy. Unfortunately, we did not kill Ragnaros. And it's because a lot of people had to leave. And, uh, yeah, I don't think, we, like, we had the... The DPS enough, and uh, personally, I had <clears throat> I had uh, not as much fire resistance that you should. So since I was off tank, I was pushed back a lot of the times. But yeah, it was uh, really fun to do, and we had a really interesting. Um, let me see if I can find it. Uh, yeah, this was really weird during Gar. Because I actually died, and it, it went so quickly, and I even have my, okay, I didn't actually have it up there, but still, it, it went down, I went down so fast, it was so quick, so yeah, it, I died there, um, Luckily, they recovered really quickly with another, uh, it was um, a druid who switched into bear form. So, it, it caused a little bit of panic first, but we we ended up, uh, like, they, they, they finished it. So, it was very nice. And let's go to the next boss, which was... Uh, it, it, it was barren, but let, I'm gonna show you. It was like these are the moments 
that you will always remember whenever this happens. So we were on this boss and we were, yeah, I don't know, like it wasn't the, it wasn't the best one, but it was so fun to do in a sense. It was very slow though, but let's just go over it and you'll see people are dying at like, what is this? Like 70% health. So. So that was just bad placement. But we. If we if we even go. If we go even further. You will see like from this point forward. From like. What's that? Like 25%. It was like this. Pretty much the rest of the fight. And we, we pulled it like way into the hallway. Back to Gar. So, let's see here. Like, we are pulling it backwards, backwards, backwards. And in the end, as you can see here, we are at Gar. And we had one mage, like, uh, de uh, decursing all the time there. And, like, one of these moments, and, like, every everyone in this card was like, Oh, come on, people, come on, come on, come on, you you can do this. And a lot of people was like, well, let's just reset instead. But the, the thing is, uh, pretty much everyone except me then had the world buffs. The, the ones that was uh, still alive. So we didn't want to like die to lose it. Um, As you can see here, there I got the, there I got the pants, uh, the flame walkers leg uh, leg plates. I got so I was super happy. And we had a little problem with the with some pack, and we did this boss. Uh, yeah, it, it was just a super fun run to do. And I'm really looking forward to doing it again. And maybe even doing it on the harder difficulty also. I'm not sure like if it's like any other gear. I haven't looked it up really. But it, to my understanding it's like it just drops more loot in a sense. At the end. And I'm just going to end, end it by showing you. Because I got pushed back a lot. So this was a wipe. And let me show you over here. So I was very unlucky with the pushbacks. And sure, I like I should have had the... I should have better there. If we go back just a little bit. Wait, there we go. So there I got the pushback. And I'm gonna get a push back to the side here. Really, really soon. And sure, this wouldn't have happened if I got better fire resistance. Obviously. But I was just, I felt like this was so so unlucky. And the raid leader said uh, that he saw it and he said it like during the when I died, it's like that was very unlucky. But here we go. And Flame me all you want. I know I could have bubbled, but I didn't. So, noobish mistake by me. A hundred percent I could have survived. But yeah, unfortunately, like, we weren't even full group. It was 90 people. 19. So, but yeah, in the end, we unfortunately wiped on, like, yeah, just a few percent. So, and we, a lot of people had to leave, so we, we called it a night, and they are gonna kill it tomorrow, I think. And I'm not gonna be able to join them, unfortunately, but hopefully I'll get Ragnaros next week. But, uh, yeah, uh, that's just a short update what has happened. I've done the raid, and the world bosses, and pretty much nothing else. I haven't, like, done anything 
at all, basically. I've done like a few quests on my rogue because when I actually got the time to do the dowsing uh, quests for for Molten Core, I've been corpse camped by like Horde all the time. So it's like, why even bother doing it at the moment? So I've been leveling a rogue a little bit. It's level 11 now, I think. Uh, yeah, it's level 11, almost level 12. Because I want to try to, I, w I really want to try a rogue tank. Because that is pretty much the only tank that I haven't played. Sure, I haven't played the other ones on max level, like level 60. But on like level 25 and like get a little bit of the feeling of it, I've done. So, and Warlock and, yeah, and Beer Tank. But I, re I really would like to try Rogue because Rogue is uh, quite unusual for me to to play like that because it's it's actually like playing a pure DPS spec, but like you are a DPS character but you're tanking, which makes it very interesting for me. And I have a few ideas that what could work and try a little bit of a like some macros, so. Who knows, that might turn up in the future. But uh, yeah, that's a small update, like I said. And click on, click on, on either of these videos and you will see a video from the past from me. And like the video and subscribe if you felt like, yeah, if you feel like doing it. And uh, yeah, I'll see you in the next video. Bork, bork!